Hello and welcome to Nature Days Outdoor Learning Resources. Today we are going to go on a spring bug hunt. Now we're just going to focus on the mini beasts that are around in the springtime and not for very long, like this little chap here. Now this is a boy St. Mark's fly. See he's just done a poo. A St. Mark's fly spend the majority of their life in the soil as little grubs and then when they're old enough they will come out and pupate and turn into these adults. Now this one comes out at St Mark's Day or close to St Mark's Day which is the 25th of April and they only come out as an adult for pretty much a week. So during that week they're very very easy to spot but they're very busy. They're not the best flyers and they land on anything which can be you or plants or trees or leaves and they're trying to mate. So what they're trying to do is to find a female and the female look very similar apart from they don't have such big bulbous heads and big bulbous eyes. And when they find their female then they will mate and then they will both die once the female has laid her eggs back in the soil. So just a week you've got to see them so look out for them flying because they're really obvious with their dangly legs and they're not very good at flying at all. My challenge for you today is to go for a spring bug hunt. So have a look and see if you can see any of those big, they're about that big, very shiny black St. Mark's flies and their back legs dangle down quite obviously. They hang around wherever you have woodland edges, a bit like here, and they love hawthorn. They're sometimes called the hawthorn bug. So look around hawthorn trees, which are just coming into flower now because they like the nectar there. And if you see one, because they're so slow and they tend to hang around a lot, see if you can draw a picture of one. If you can't, take a photo, see if you can draw one from that photo. And then maybe we'll look at some other spring bugs, see if you can draw them. There's some great spring bugs which hang around. They don't go very fast and it's a great opportunity to look at how they move, look at the different sections of their body and look at them in really great detail. So good luck and I'd love to see any of your pictures of your spring bugs or any photos of spring bugs that you've seen in your garden that you want to identify. So please put them on the Facebook page, Nature Days, or you can tweet them, hashtag Nature Days, and good luck.